All right, so the next key aspect of technical analysis that I want to share with you is what I call the support resistant reversal phenomenon. So this phenomenon was actually not first identified by me, but by this very legendary trader called Jazzy Livermore, who lives during the Great Depression era. If you could still remember, it happened in the year 1929. So Jazzy Livermore was a very famous trader called the Boy Plunger because he made a lot of money during the Great Depression uh, when he actually noticed this phenomenon and used this phenomenon to great effect. And he made a lot of money during the market crash while a lot of people committed suicide because they lost a lot, a lot of money in the financial markets at that point in time. So he noticed this phenomenon and uh, subsequently he actually wrote a book about it. And uh, it is this phenomenon actually uh, still lives on today. And I would say that one of the main reasons why this phenomenon still happens is because over the past 100 years, uh, human nature has not changed. So that's the reason why this phenomenon is still happening today. I'm going to share with you what this phenomenon is about. Uh, from the angle of technical analysis and how you can potentially use it to your advantage or to get an edge in terms of the trading strategy that you use. So what these phenomenon try to illustrate is that uh, when a certain key resistance after it has come back, especially after you have hit a certain resistance for a number of times, if finally the time where it finally overcomes this key resistance, the next time the price pullbacks that level, it will become a support level. 